Hello students. In this video, we will see the continuous system for transverse vibration. The name of the activity is to find the frequency equation of a uniform, uniform beam fixed at one end and free at other end for transverse vibration. So, in case of a transverse vibration, uh, a beam is there which is fixed at one end and free at other end and we need to find out the frequency equation. Now we know that uh, for fixed end condition, uh, the displacement or sorry, the deflection is zero. Similarly, uh, at this uh, fixed end, the slope of the deflection is also zero. So del y by del x is equal to zero for value of x as zero. Similarly, at free end, the bending moment is zero. So del square y by del x square at L comma T is zero and shear force is also zero at uh, at free end. So del cube Y by del X cube at L comma T is equal to zero. So these are the boundary conditions for fixed end and free end in case of a transverse vibrations for a beam. Now the general solution equation for transverse vibration is given by y x comma t is equal to a hyperbolic cos of cx plus b hyperbolic sine of cx plus c cos cx plus d sine cx. So this is the general solution equation for transverse vibration. First we will put the boundary conditions at the free end that is uh, the deflection uh, at the start or at the fixed end is zero. So if you put uh, the value of x is 0 in this equation, you will get a plus c equal to 0 that means c is equal to minus a. Then we will put the second boundary conditions del y by del x for that we need to differentiate uh, this equation. So here we have differentiated this equation and again put the value of del y by del x as 0. So here we obtained b plus d is equal to 0 that is d equal to minus b. So these are the two relations that we obtained. That means uh, this equation is reduced to two constants only, a and b, whereas c and d are replaced by a and b. Okay. So uh, for finding the bending moment uh, equation, we differentiate further with respect to x and put the value of x as l because at the at the free end the bending moment is zero. So we put the value of x is L and uh, this is the equation for bending moment and this we equate it with, this, with respect to 0. Similarly, we differentiate it further. So del cube y by del x cube for finding the shear force and uh, this is the equation that we obtain. And when you solve these two equations simultaneously and find out the value of a and b and when you put uh, the value of a and b in the main equation, the equation is reduced to hyperbolic cos Cl into cos Cl is equal to zero. So by putting the four boundary conditions and finding the uh, arbit arbitrary constants, uh, this uh, general solution equation is reduced to this one. And when you solve this, uh, reduced equation, you will get the frequency equation or frequency value. Okay, so this is this is how boundary conditions for transverse vibrations are. For free end, the the deflection and the slope is zero, and at sorry at fixed end, the deflection and slope is zero, and at free end, bending moment and shear force is zero. And by applying those boundary conditions to the general solution equation, you can easily find out uh, the value of frequency. So I hope you have understood uh, the continuous system with transverse vibration. So thank you very much.